Good morning, YouTube. It's Ryan from Metallica, deep in the heart of Texas. <laughs> That's where I'm at. I just got up. <clears throat> it's Saturday. How's your Saturday going? Ours is just getting started. So, starting off the little vlog. We'll do a vlog for Saturday as we've done the last however many Saturdays. And, uh, Show you a sneak peek behind the scenes of running a small business, mom and pop, family stuff. I have no idea what's going to happen today. Should be fun. Oh, what you doing? Hi, Pepper. Stretch. What? What's happening in here? <laughs> <laughs> Leave me alone. Then. I'm trying to put. You can tell I'm trying so hard to put this bookshelf together. You gotta. She's keeping me company while I sit here and trust me. <laughs> you got a biscuit. Yeah. On the couch. Yeah. It's, a... it's early. It's early, yeah. I just gotta mm -hmm. build a shelf to match that shelf. Yes, I'm building a shelf because I have books. Because last weekend, or weekend before last, last weekend, I cleaned out the garage. That's well, right. I have, like a whole bunch of books that need to be put on the shelf. So I ran out of shelf space. And, yeah. Yes, because I bought you some shelves yesterday. Yes, you did. Yesterday? Yes, it was yesterday. Yes, you did. And I ended up being late for work. Yes. <laughs> my you boss did. was so upset oh I was gosh. late. I know. <laughs> I almost wrote myself up. Yes. I did. Yes. I should though. I'll do that. I'll write myself up today. So you're not waiting for me to put this together. Oh heck no. I love I love putting the shelves together. It's my favorite thing to do, believe it or not, because it's creative. And I love being creative. So um yeah, no, I love this, believe it or not. This is people dread it and hate it, but I love it. I so, love that you love it. It's so much fun. Such fun. It's like a giant Lego. Thing. It is. So, Mita, what are you doing? Biscuits. See, I'm still dirty from being outside. And I'm a princess. She's not a princess. She's been in the bed with me this morning. I'm the princess. Scratching and spinning. Yeah. Speaking of biscuits, mmm, you made some biscuits. Mm -hmm. Good. I'm hungry. Homemade. Homemade from scratch biscuits. You're amazing. <laughs> Homemade from packaged biscuits. Ooh. <clears throat> it's sunshiny. We're October 29th. Trying to get to the shop a little bit early this morning. Didn't quite succeed. Because uh, me and Angela have to shoot a video together before we open the shop. We'll see if that happens. So excited. Hey, well, we're about to shoot our FAQ. Yes. And uh, super excited. Right. We're going to go. So that's where the video camera is. Mm -hmm. And of course, we got. We're going to use the nice mic today on the Ask RNA video. Yes. So that was this morning shooting. Shooting Ask RNA, which might be up later today. And this Yay. vlog will probably be up tomorrow. Who knows? Yep, that's what we're hearing. <clears throat> Is that good? That looks great. That's not your natural hair, by the way. No, mine's. There it is. <laughs> she got a wig, but it, it pretty looks, cool looking wig though. It looks cool. Seventies. <laughs> <laughs> Howdy, y'all. Hi, guys. It's Ryan. And Angela. I don't know if you could tell, but it really is us. Yeah. Happy Halloween weekend. Ooh. Deep in the heart of Texas, that's where we're at right now. That's right. Or not. Right. Nose running, yeah. Mm. I have a natural nose catcher. Ew. Little tin. <laughs> They're a little bigger. They're about this size, but triangular in shape with the really sharp, nice edges. 
they're really good for like speed picking. Mm. That's actually an ancestor. I forgot you had that one in your hand. That's more the traditional shape. Yeah, I like that one. The no. saber tooth is more for speed picking. Some of the metal guys. It's I think I have a blank in here. I don't. What is that? That was an early, early, early prototype that goes in the vault. Yeah, here's a blank for the uh, for the saber tooth. You can see it; it's quite a bit more pointy, but it's got it'll ha it has the bevels on it. Once I cut the bevels in it. <laughs> Hi there. Hey. So Pete was just uh, selling guitar picks. Selling guitar picks at the shop. So I'm gonna let him talk about. You walk in randomly, and there's a guy that's like, ooh, I like that pick. What do you want to do? What is that? It's a guitar pick. I make guitar picks. Rosebud guitars. And picks. And picks. But, yeah. But, yeah, he, uh, he was really digging this RNA signature pick. This one's made out of Delrin. Mm -hmm. It's two millimeters, nice and thin, but he really liked the feel of the wood. Yeah, particularly. Get that to focus. That one's made out of Pau Ferro. This one's made out of Ebony. Got these here. These are my personal picks. We've got a 22 millimeter beast. That's a mammoth. Super mammoth. Super mammoth. Says the Viking. <laughs> we got a, a hoss. Which is, I think this one's eight millimeters, nice and thick. And we also do some stuff out of polycarbonate, quite a bit stronger than the acrylic. Same basic thing, it's just a lot stronger, a little harder to work with, but it's good stuff. That's gonna be my next one. Yes, Ryan put in his order a little while ago for another couple of his RNA signature picks. Gonna get working on those probably tomorrow. As well as the ones we just sold. Yeah. That's pretty cool. So, just happened to stop in and oh, somebody's I started, interested. Yeah, I started telling him about the uh, the pick guard that you made for the Schecter. Yes. Because you were playing, he was, Pete was playing the, the Schecter. And I told the guy, oh, yeah, well, this is Pete. He makes guitars and guitar picks. And he actually made this pick guard for me. Mm -hmm. and he's like, oh, wow. Then I was like, he was talking about picks. We both got our hair cut at the same place this morning, and he uh, he said that Jesse from Bearded Barbershop here in Canton uh, suggested, oh, there's a guy that was just in here who makes guitars, guitar picks, and the like, and then he runs into me here at RNA and wanted to buy some picks. So. That's crazy. I got my beard trimmed at the Bearded Barber. I got my hair did. So, he's a good guy. Good guy. Cleaned it up. Clean it up just, don't take anything off the length, just clean up the sides, because I'm going to try to go with my buddy Adam Lamar the whole year and a half beard and see what happens. I'm sticking with the Fu Manchu. I don't know if I can make it that long, but we'll try it. So. I'm thinking about bringing my handlebar mustache back. Really? Like the whole... Yeah, just the full, you know, the twisty. The and... Kansas Law Dog uh -huh. mustache. Yep. <laughs> I think you should. Like, I've had it before. I think you'd be cheating yourself if you didn't. <laughs> <laughs> and everyone else. <laughs> All right, maybe I will. Maybe I will. We'll see. Yeah. All right, so speaking of FAQs, what video editing software are you using? Uh, right now, I'm just using iMovie. iMovie. Believe it or not. I, okay. On the desktop computer, I use some cheap AVS. Mm -hmm. It was like 40 bucks for the license. So it was a $40 video editor, but it was way better than Windows Movie Maker. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Movie Maker terrible. was super frustrating terrible. and terrible. made me angry. And so AVS works great. I used that for like our first 450 videos or mm -hmm. something. And then I bought the Mac, and I've just been using iMovie. Cool. Like I figured I would upgrade to Final Cut Pro one mm -hmm. of these days. But uh, I just started with the iMovie, and it works really good. It works as good as the other one I was using. If it Actually, works, it works better. It works. You know, Final Cut is like you're cutting movies. Right. And like commercials and TV shows, like. Right. Full on legit stuff, and you may maybe don't really need that for just some YouTube videos. So it works pretty good. Cool. Here's the um, the Ask RNA that I shot earlier today, and it's it's transferring now, so it, it might be up this evening. 
And then tomorrow will probably be today's vlog. Sweet. With special guest Pete from Rosebud Guitars. I might just need to, instead of being a special guest, become a... We should have a segment. <laughs> could. <laughs> we could talk about luthier tips Become or a, uh, a regular contributor. There you go. Could do that. Yeah, with that. Be fun. I'm sure we could uh, come up with some questions like guitar building stuff. Yeah. Because I don't know a lot about that. We could do some luthier tips and tricks. Luthier tips with Pete. <laughs> Why not? Because he doesn't just build picks. He does make guitars. Do guitars, and among other things, but picks and guitars and custom uh, speaker cabinets and pedal boards. And I thought I'd be come to your to your garage and film a little bit of you actually working on. <laughs> once I clean it out. <laughs> no, you got to be real. Just be real. I'll be real once it's clean. <laughs> Selective. We'll do a really close up shot. There we go. Close up shots of just the hands doing the. Doing the. This. See? We can do that soon. <laughs> we can do that soon. All right. Actually, man. I've been working on cleaning it out, so we're getting there. Uh, you know, it's a process. It is process. Just like most of life. But cool, dude. Awesome. All right, man. Hold you later. See ya. So I'm trying to download Google Chrome for my MacBook so I can actually download uh, my little part of the Uncle Book and Jalapeno Overdrive CD. Uh, kind of an early thing for the musicians who performed on it. But I gotta have Google Chrome for some reason. And then the other computer is uploading the Ask RNA from this morning. I'm gonna leave it uploading from the computer here at the shop because it'll go a little bit faster than if I uploaded it from the house because there are people watching TV and Netflix and things at the house that would use up the bandwidth. So I thought you might enjoy this. I've been trying to do a demo video. This is the problem with demo videos. Like I answered in the Ask RNA video that will be up today, which is yesterday probably if you're seeing this. Um, I just ran out of time. So we've had pretty much since I got here this morning, Angela and I shot the Ask RNA video, but after that I've had people in uh, most of the day. So I haven't had a chance to do any demos, but what I'm trying to do a demo of is my lovely new 30th anniversary PRS SE Custom 24. Yeah. Custom 24 PRS SE. Oh, and like some kind of walnut stain. Pretty sexy guitar. Very nice. Got this a while back. I did an unboxing video that I haven't even uploaded. <laughs> um, but I haven't even done the demo yet. It's a cool guitar. But it was on the agenda for today. But um, we're closed and it's time to go home. I got to go do some family stuff. Well, I just want to go home and relax. Sometimes that's important. But I brought it to work in case I had time to shoot a little demo. But I didn't. On the road again. Driving home. Actually, I'm going to swing into the gas station real quick. And get me a naughty beverage. A naughty beverage before I go home. With caffeine in it. Not that kind of naughty beverage, you guys. You guys, you sauce monsters. <laughs> A naughty caffeinated beverage. So excited. Comfy and 
and realized I uh, forgot some stuff at the shop that I needed to get. There you are. Found you. Number one, I forgot my rechargeable AA batteries for the uh, Xbox One controller. Need these so I can go play Skyrim and I forgot some stuff for Angela. So. But, luckily, batteries in hand. Time to go play some Skyrim or Fallout or edit a video, I don't know. And Aiden's Kalanasil sword that I, uh, I left here <laughs> as part of my Viking costume. So, uh, yeah. Gotta bring that home to the little guy. The boy loves his swords. Who doesn't? Well, it looks like you got your bookshelf put together. I did. I'm not done organizing, but... There's too much light behind you. Ah! Yeah. I'm not done yet, but it's getting there. I have to sit back and reevaluate. At least you've achieved balance with the force. Yeah. Books on either side. Yeah. There is better light. Well, okay. People get the gist. They get the idea. Yes. So. How long did that take you to put together? Oh, uh, not long. Maybe an hour. What do you want? Somebody's playing Fallout 4. I have a dog on my lap. Sure. And I'm talking to Pat David Gray. He's in Australia right now. Crikey. Why would I make the same mistake? What are you doing? What are you doing? What are you doing? Are you, are you excited, Pepper? Pepper. So excited. Dang biscuits. Stop it. The dang dogs had dug up the dirt behind our air conditioner unit. So we tried fencing it off. They dug it out anyway. Stupid dogs. Get your water, Roxy. Roxy! What? Don't give me wet, you big old hoss. my foot Sarah Back up. well it's uh, Saturday evening sounds about to go down in Texas not in Georgia in Texas it's already down in Georgia I bet anyways so I'm gonna wrap this video up for how's your Saturday going I'm going to go uh, watch Aiden play some Fallout 4 and then I'm gonna commandeer the Xbox one and play some Skyrim Till late, late, late tonight. <clears throat> Hope you guys had a great day. Hope your weekend's awesome. Keep the music alive. Don't forget it. This dang monster dog keeps interrupting my video. Keep the music alive. Have a great weekend, guys. Bye. Sarah. She's eating a lion. A lion. You ate Simba.